it's important to understand that the insurance company of the person who hits you, their, their adjusters and lawyers have been trained to be very kind and friendly up front. But they're not your, they're not your friend. Um, their job is to minimize or deny your claim. So everything they're talking to you about, every question they ask you, every angle that they take is designed to minimize what they have to do for you. And so don't be fooled by um, you know, them being friendly on the face of things. Uh, because deep down, and maybe not so deep, they're, they're your enemy. They're the ones that are working against you. We've had lots of scenarios where people will go to insurance companies um, and say, hey, look, I don't, I don't really want to make this a big deal. Can we resolve this on the side? Uh, I can think of, of several offhand, but, but one in particular that, that comes to mind from uh, a couple of years ago, I had a, an individual come in that had banged his knee really bad on, on the dashboard from an accident. Uh, the insurance company was offering him $5,000 to, uh, to resolve his case. They told him that they wouldn't pay him a penny more, but that, that but they were doing him a huge favor. Um, this client came and, and talked to me, fortunately, about it and said, you know, what do you think? And I said, well, what's the nature of your injury? And he said, well, my knee is just killing me. He hadn't even had it checked out, but yet the insurance company was trying to get him to, to settle. He goes to the doctor, turns out that he, that he needs knee surgery. Uh, he has a knee surgery, heals up nice, um, and we were able to get him uh, significantly more money to help not only pay for the medical expenses, but to put uh, in his pocket to help him deal with, with the challenge that he went through. Uh, another, another good example of, of not trusting the insurance company is uh, a young lady was in a, in a rollover accident last year. Well, it's probably a year and a half ago now. But she, uh, after the accident, her parents went to the insurance company. They said, uh, this is all we can offer you. We, this is all the money there is. We're not, we can't pay you anymore. And it was about $50,000. And, and her medical bills were over three hundred thousand. Um, it wasn't until they came to me we were able to to look into the case closely, and we realized that what they were representing to to her was was false. Um, the underlying coverage was three hundred thousand or fifty thousand dollars, but there was what they call an umbrella policy involved as well, for another million dollars. And through our efforts, we were able to get all million dollars of that policy to benefit our client.